Hello everyone, Happy here, jumping back into Cataclysmo. This is a little indie game that I'm liking a lot. You control a group of survivors that have fled the mist where there you see things called the horrors live. Uh, it turns out people were turned into the horrors themselves, but it's kind of a base building survival game. We had just defended the Solar Gate, and we're going to try to figure out what's happening next. If you like these videos, hit the subscribe button. I'm doing an entire playthrough of this demo. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new, uh, or if you like it, also hit the like button. Let's jump into it. Let's see what the next mission has in store for us. I am liking this game though. I'm not the best at building, so I'm hoping to get a bit better at it as I play it more. That night, Iris defended the city gates from the horrors of the mist. With her peers in the order, our sworn defenders. Yet, this was not the first time Ogar stood against its enemies. Thirty years before that night, while the Order was once again fighting for their families, for all of us, a quiet sound began that would change our history. And when the Perla scholars opened their door, there she was. Between her tiny arms, a Perla embedded in her chest. You already know, a Perla is not a trivial thing. You could die just by touching one. And yet here was an infant with one of these things inside her. She'll die without us. She's a horror in disguise, I tell you. A horror. One looked on in silence. And when she stepped forward, all arguments ceased. She carries a bird light, yes. But also a book. Rectora Elena. She always seemed to understand things. Others could not. Do we not value knowledge? The child? The child is a beacon. Bring her in. Call her... Edis. So, the scholars of the Ivory adopted the girl as their own child. And she grew like any other. Slowly, but steadily. Always carrying her book filled with stories from the past. But Iris was not any other child. As soon as the scholars allowed it, she became a chief defender of the city. And what does a good defender do when an attacker becomes too bold? She plays it smart. She goes in search of answers among the trees, beyond the walls. If we had known what she would come to face, Ciudad Ogar would have shut all doors and windows, and for the first time in centuries, prayed. Are those our troops? Oh no, she's staying with her back to the horrors? Oh gosh, what's going on here? Hmm, I see you've made yourself comfortable, Hermes. From the war table, Iris decides your next destination. Each castle figure marks a male mission. Click on any mission to start it. Okay. All right, bird brain. What say you to a ramble in the forest? I need to know what's going on. Interesting. What's this green one? Oh, it's a tutorial mission. Okay, I understand. So let's go to this one. Difficulty medium. Here's still no more from the forest garrison. Go if the worst is happening to rebuild. Okay. Oop, let's pull everyone else out of the way. Oh no. The garrison. It's in tatters. I never thought this place would fall. What falls can rise, Harold. We need to get this settlement working again. Your citadel is your settlement heart. It must not fail. If stores and natural resources like if stores are oh, if stores and natural resources like wood, which we needed to build your fortress. Settlements need other buildings to grow. You cannot place buildings such as sawmill outside your citadel's territory. But pieces such as stone bricks can be built on the outside these limits. We shall need okay. wood before all else. Wood is from these okay. As the foundation of the settlement's economy. Build a sawmill close to the trees. Oh, I can fit two up here. Sounds good. So let's go over here. Resource gatherers. Let's just copy what they just did. 
Let's throw a sawmill off the side. Constructing this will take a moment. And we should build some steps side. to the sawmill while that is underway. Um, all buildings need to clear a path to your citadel. If the rear sail is, is obstructed, that building will shut down and won't operate. Okay. So let's see here. It wants us to build some stairs. We can do this. Do we have infinite building here for a second? That's pretty cool. Like putting if I don't have any build limit, I feel like I'm gonna put two here. Whew, sorry, I had to sneeze there for a second. Here we go. Back to this. Do do do. Okay, here we go. So now we have two stairs up. Those are building. We are that's right. Do three. Mm -hmm. Come up here. How did you get up here? It's a side gate. Okay. That is not a moat or anything I can draw. So our wall's pretty banged up. Well, that's our total build up top, I understand. Well, there's senior Excellent. pieces, I can't touch them. The workers are gathering wood now. Okay. Sawmill spawn workers that carry wood to the nearest storage area. For now, that's your citadel. Workers can collect resources much if you build them shorter routes. Oh, okay. We'll need somewhere for folk to live. They sell many citizens without a supply assistance. You may be unable to place new buildings. Okay. So let's see. So it looks like it wants us to build over here, which sounds good to me. Let's go plus four citizens, plus four citizens, okay. Buildings can be destructed with a recycler tool or pressing recycle on the panel. Use this to refresh anything like stone or wood, okay. Sounds good. It says build four buildings, so let's do that. Oh, it says build three. I built four. What's so they come down the stairs. I'm curious how their path works. Do they have to get up inside or just to the front door? So if needed, I'll low oxygen production. Oh, what? The air here, it's stale with mist. Is there a way to remove that? Here's what you need to say supply of oxygen to survive in the mist. Keep an eye on your oxygen production to avoid running out of air to breathe. Air filters, okay. Air filters collect oxygen, but also need height to work effectively. So let's see if I can't put some up here. Okay, so the higher up the air filters are, the better. Must be high. Oh. Okay, one second. So let's go over here. Now, I feel like building it in the back over here probably isn't the end of the world. So let's just go... Actually, can I build off of this? That's the way up. So I'm going to build it on this side. It's module. Though unluckily, if we get attacked, immediately this thing's gonna fall. And then 
do I have to build a pathway up to here, do you think? I would guess I have to. I can't, though. Oh, I guess I can walk over here. Okay, let's build that. Let's see how it goes. Should we do next? So that's air builders going up. Actually, I can just pass forward. I forgot. These few shacks are but the start. We have more work to do. Okay. Oh, do we have a. But the more? day for us was nearly done. Oh no. Or being attacked from two Ambush! Directions. They were waiting for sundown! Fight for your lives! Oh, okay. Eyes open, masks on. That's less than ideal. I don't really have any walls of wood I can make, can I? Maybe we get some reinforcements? There's not, oh, I was going to say, I hope there's not a lot of them as a gazillion of them come through the front door. Wait, here's a question. We're just going to throw a bunch of wooden struts here. Can I just slow them down? We'll find out. They're under attack. Oh, they look right. Oh no. This is not great. There's a lot of people here. Hey, what's that? hey workers, can I build a way for you to come up the other side? Because that might be the safest thing to do. Uh, maybe I should. Oh, what was this? Too many. This, this cannot be how it ends. Rectora Elena, I've been wondering, what would we do if one of our perlas got, I don't know, compromised? Would it be lost forever? That is a compelling question, little scholar. Our chroniclers say that in the lost reign, humans were able to fold the cloth of time itself for short periods. Oh. That way, even the most terrible mistakes could be undone. Of course, that Arte of the Palido was lost in the Cataclysmo. But with training, my little sage, I'm confident you will discover it again. Terrible mistakes undone? We were a wine time. Time anchor. Oh, so let you try again. This is my only choice to stop this. I need to fold time itself. <laughs> Well, that's a powerful ability. Okay, so I need to find a quarry or something to build better walls. So we're going to explore more than last time. Have I... Did it work? I can't believe it. I'm back. A few hours before the attack, it looks like. This is too much. We fell here. I... No. I cannot let this moment pass. Another chance. Another choice. Okay. We should gather some stone before... Lady Iris, are, are you alright? I am fine. Stone, you say? Uh, yeah, we need that. Shines. We will prevail. 
how interesting. She can rewind time and try to help out our people. Oh, and it looks like there's loot up here, too. Yeah? I'm on it. Maybe you go that way. Hmm. Resource gallery. Okay. Good. I think I'll lay up. These minerals. If we build a quarry here, it will gather stone for our walls. Okay. Well spotted. But our territory doesn't reach that far. At least not yet. A Solomon's territory can be expanded with beacons, but a beacon must be built inside a territory, just like other buildings. Okay. So one second, so let's go over here. Where... Okay, so I can put the beacon way up here, and that expands to all of that. So let's do that. I don't have to worry about messing up our area. Hey, Bowman. Hmm? Over here. I've got this. Let's fast forward for a second. We are... Mm -hmm. Post me. Hmm. Actually, you all. Eyes open. That's right. Where to? Excellent. Our territory now extends to the stone deposit. Let's start gathering. Okay, build quarries to obtain supply of stones and minerals. Each, okay, the vision of each quarry depends on how much resources are nearby. One second, let's, let's pause. Go over here because we now know that we need all the time in the world. Medium, medium, produces yield. That's not a great yield. So let's just start rotating. Five seem to be the best. Sounds good to me. Generating a good amount of oxygen. We have an extra worker. Build a core with a clear path to the citadel. It does have a clear path to the citadel, so that should be fine. Hmm. For some reason, I can't walk up here. Let's see if there's a fog wall. Masks on. But we're going to explore a bit. So we know they come through this main area down here. We want to trap it up. But it looks like they also came, at least from the other night, it looks like they also came from over here. That will do. Now, let's rebuild those walls. Yes, we definitely need to fix these walls up because we got ruined last time. So stone pieces. Let's put down some large bricks. There we go. A smaller brick. And large brick, large brick. Oops. Oh wow, so these large ones here are actually the most cost-efficient ones. Because these are three apiece, and then these are five, which is a little more cost-efficient. But then this one should be nine, but it's only six, so that's... Oh, maybe not, I lied. Twos are the most cost-efficient. Okay, so let's rebuild a good portion of this. I don't want to pause. Pause. Okay. So, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, here we go, oh, not that one. Those filthy horrors won't reach us so easily now. Do not be so sure. Night arrives, and our rebuilding efforts have attracted them. Take positions. The night is nearly here. Hmm? Yes. Oh, we don't have a staircase up. Okay, one second. Um... So if I do, I'm going to do this the easiest way possible. We're going to do one, two, three, one, two, 
one, two, one, and then stairs, one, two, three, four. And then I'll do the same thing going this way. Okay. Keep it simple. Perfect. And then we know we're getting attacked on this side too. So let's let them run in. I'm just going to wall this up as quick as I can. Even if I have to just put wooden pieces out here. It slows them down even a little bit. It's positive. Person range boost here. One second. Perfect. This is for when the first wall falls, so that should work out pretty well for us. And I don't have enough stone yet. Mm. Okay, just dozens this time. That looks much more plausible. Is that loot? Okay, we'll wait till the next day to see if that loot can get down to us. Now we have 23 stone. So let's go over here and then build a damage boost. Okay, got that damage boost going down. We'll fast forward the game speed, try to get through the first night. I wish I knew how to build more survivors. I do want to wall this off as well. We are needed. Yeah. Oh, looks like the night's right away. Not on just yet. So let's run over here. Oh, wait a minute, that, that's Doing about it. to be night. One second, get over here. The horrors are coming. Okay. So we have our makeshift wall. Close down a little bit. That's fine. Okay, so the way left one is more. They got walls. Hey, helps out any little bit. Slow down. We won, but this was only a bite at our ankles. They're testing us. You have no idea, Hogardin. Prepare for more conflict. I don't know if this is the right idea, but I figured if we build. Hiding won't be enough to survive the night. We have to put up a fight. Okay, so what is this? Without a strong army, it's only a matter of time before these fiends break through. Oh, nice. Train men and women to defend against the horrors of the mist. Sounds good. Troops can be trained in military barracks, such as barracks. Okay. By default, troops will rally at the door of the barracks. You can set a new rally point barracks pressing right mouse button with a flag. Troops together. Okay. So one second, city building, barracks. Let's put this over here. Or about our logging area? Or should I put up top by the logs? I could use it as a fortification. Just 
plug it in right to this wall. I think that's not a terrible idea. Hey guys, we'll get this. Loose. We will prevail. That mist is still up. I don't know if I can build a brazer out over here because that will work. Hmm. So we're, ma we're still making oxygen. But I probably will need to build another oxygen thing. So it needs to be high up. This is not enough space here. Well, I can build down here though. should be plenty but now we have to build the ridiculous amount of wooden structure to get up to there build the beacon okay and then we want another Airflow up here. Okay. Low up. With the barracks ready, we can start training troops. For Ogar. Grab all those. So, training troops. So, pause, select barracks. Okay, so this requires wood and less gold. Hmm. And less oxygen. Deals low damage to multiple targets in a very small area. Lars are critical when facing enemies in huge numbers. I want to go archers, but maybe I can figure out a way to do lobbers as well. Not enough wood. Oh man, okay, just kidding. We have negative on the wood. Oh, wait, wait. as well and you guys rally over to here eyes open good can't get up there yet well, let's just keep exploring for a we're under attack oh come where where are we under attack from masks on mm -hmm. that's right I don't see anything. Oh, oh, they're right here. Huh? Mm hmm. Oh man, they're taking on our wall. I didn't even notice them. Uh huh. Hmm? On it. The valley, yes. Hmm. Quickly. Is there a way to repair? Break out, put another brick in. I can. Oh, so I like that. How do you do? How do we do that? Oh, an arch door. Because I feel like that would be good for the lobber if I put it just right up here. 
Okay, okay, wait. Now we're getting somewhere. Because this is what we were looking for. The doorway that could throw stuff. So, I want to... We're going to move... This part of the wall. Sorry, wall. We're trying to figure you out. Okay, I don't want to waste anything yet. So before I get to the cap, we're going to pause. So I want to build this. So that wants to still be there. We want our... We haven't get too high. I don't know if that's the right height. Lovers, if I click on the lover, does it tell me? The pallido I'm shines. Ready. Tech cooldown. Small unit. Does eight damage. Four meters or less above target increases splash damage. Makes sense. So this is one meter. Oh. Oh, I didn't even have to do it. He was fine up there. I overthought it. I overthought it. Okay. Yeah, okay. You go back up here. We are going to put this back into the wall. That is my fault. Okay, so then we have all of our ranged boosts here. Huh? Uh-huh. Okay, increase your military cast by researching the Citadel. Okay, you may research things at your Citadel. So if I click here, perfect. There you guys, get up here. Yes, on my way. Yeah, makes sense. Okay, one second then, we're going over here. Thicken this other wall. I should probably build the door. Hmm. 
I can't recycle that one. That's unfortunate. Nope. Okay, I don't like any of that. Let's undo all of that. We build there. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? We need a pathway to get to this area. We should move that door. But I need a door in this wall. So one second. Let's just do this. And we'll figure this out. So here we go. We're gonna go ground piece. That's done. Fill her up, that one's good. Fill up, that one's good. Okay. Those have stopped freaking out. Then we get to our double doors here. Boom, put that door down. And then, can we... I don't know if this is how it works, but we're gonna try to double up our double doors. Okay. That looks better. And then... Not enough stone. All right. Research complete. We can have more military units. Not enough wood. So we're doing pretty good. We have a lot of minerals. I wish we had more stone to mine from. Not enough wood. Hmm. Okay, I never even checked to see where these guys path through, so it's this door. So the quickest way down is always the best way, it looks like. Oh, we got a few attacks around here. Okay. Low oxygen production. But we're still we're still positive, so that's fine. It's definitely lower than I want, but it's not the end of the world. I feel like I should try to build more. Maybe I can build one up here. Okay, wait, we're gonna take an yep. archer. Mm-hmm. They're gonna come up over there. Post me high. I will open. I'm on it. Why don't you get up over there? Mm -hmm. Where to? I've got this. Yeah. Okay. You guys wanna huh? work on right away. down enemies. Oh, you don't know how to get there. Oh, I don't have a path. Oh, I forgot this wasn't a path. Um, here, let's remove this. So stones, not weirdly enough, not as important now. Oh, wait, that's not gonna work. I'm gonna do it one more over. Might as well do it on the stone side, actually. Yes. Hmm. Yeah. On it. I'm on it. I'm just curious. Do you have the range to shoot down there? You do. See, we have this kind of messed up tower over here, which we can start to build to. Which I 
which wouldn't be bad. I'm trying to think about where I'm going to put more of our... more connected. Well, that way, that path is all the way up. That's pretty great. But we have low oxygen and low minerals, and I can't do anything with minerals. But I need to build more oxygen towers. So let's say. Can I build? I need to get more wood. I wonder if Not I can enough wood. Put one up here. That's what I'm saying. Oh, uh huh. Yeah. Hey, you guys, come on over here. Over. It needs to be higher, not enough space, not enough support. Okay. I don't know if that'll work, but that'll be cool if it does. What? Yeah? Good. We could use some traps around our walls. Traps can be set up to damage approaching horrors. Traps are handy, but are destroyed after some use. You won't get any resources back when recycling them. That's fine. Right. It costs 15. Oh, I don't have nearly anything yeah. left there. Mm. Wish I could get up to here, though. I think I see loot, but I want it. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Okay, so that's the building that lacks half the citadel. That's fine. Let's do that one, that one. stairs. See horrors coming in, let's run away. Yeah, right. Good. Perfect. Go back to the wall. Makes sense. I really wish I could do something with the minerals that we have. citizens maybe I could do better um, okay so we have seven citizens max is available seven max is 36 so I don't think I have I don't think I'm capped
That's what the game's trying to tell me. Okay, so let's fast forward for a second. Wants us to build traps in critical spots. I want to build traps all along the front here. Oh. Am I not getting any more resources? Oh, no, I am. Traps. Put along our wall here. Those spikes will be useful. What else could we do to better our odds? We shouldn't neglect the surrounding wilds. There's always useful salvage to be found out there. That's what's. Yeah. What? Makes sense. Go quick. Post me. I've got this. The night is nearly here. Night will be here soon. Let's use this time wisely. Yeah, a solid plan. Okay, so it's scores and scores. And then we want a damage boost. So let's figure out how we're going to do this. This feels like a good idea. And then we go over to here. Damage boost up. I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah. Doing it. Huh? Hmm. Okay, so we have five over this wall. We have a few over more on this wall. Okay, so that's looking a little bit better. Let's get some traps out in front here. We're out of resources. Now I do have a lot more stone. So I will just throw up pseudo walls out in front just to slow things down. Like, looks like they're coming in from over here. So if I do... Actually, I wonder if I... I quickly do this, right? Okay. Then we take want to do this here and then here for our six guys but then we need to do we need to do one more set of walls then okay and then I need these for our six We'll put those on our corner, and then actually we front that. Oh, I don't get anything back from refunding that. I should have it. Okay. I don't know if we can walk through our own traps is our problem. Should have probably checked that out before I did what I was thinking. But that's okay. Uh, stone. If I do one block here, I should be able to do... Stairs up, stairs up. Okay. Yes? Right away. Hmm? Mm-hmm. Okay, one second. Yes. You are gonna go On here. It. Yeah? Yeah. You are gonna Good. go here. Where to? You are mm. gonna go there. Okay. Okay. I don't know if I have enough units. But I figured a secondary auxiliary wall would not be a bad idea. And we'll put some traps out in front of it as well. As quick as we can. 
Come on, we just need a little more wood. Try. I probably should have made it more efficient to get down there, to be honest. That's okay. Get ready to battle. Take position. Oh, you uh, know where I'm right now. Oh wow, the lobbers are really good. They just take out so many people. Yeah, that box. Wow, they chop through that real quick. These ones are a bit taller. The higher, the better. Okay, this is actually looking pretty good. How's the front gate doing? Front gate looking okay. Wow, we actually like health. Where to? And this is a total two. Exhausted. Yet, we won. Huge. Is that the mission? But that Arte, this folding of time, I feel. Lady Iris, take her quickly. Oh no. Insight gained one. That's new. Total Sonic Economics defense at a low cost. View level stats. Let's see. We gathered 6,000, we gathered a ton of resources, stone of stone, buildings lost, pieces lost, okay. Kill death ratio, 2 to 119, nothing. View stats. So, that is where we're going to end this video. Actually, we'll hit the continue button to see where it goes. I think that might be the end of the demo, I'm not positive. We'll see where this goes, it's already a pretty long one. Oh, I do really like this game. Oh, what is this? You fell unconscious after defending the forest garrison. Iris, who is coming? So she told them what she saw. Oh. A dream. Or a prophecy. Your perla. You are attuned to the Palido in a way none of us are. Your vision is not to be ignored. The horrors will get worse. Perhaps it is time, Rectora. That we sought once again the Alta Pearl. The Alta Pearl? Don't talk of that poison chalice. It is what the girl saw. Fabled to be the primal source of the Palido. A way to stop the horrors. It lies buried with our ancestors. Even those of the Lost Reign could not master such a thing. There is a risk, yes. But... Rectora, if this... Alta Pearl gives us a chance to undo the Cataclysmo. We should seek it. Iris, I know you're not like the rest of us, but every expedition for the Alta Pearl has... They do not come back. I saw it. It is... calling me. Your scholar is right. I have to go. We better prepare our troops. Let's not be hasty. It's the best chance we have. It will be a death sentence. Enough. I've made a decision. It will be Edis's duty to travel through the old lands as our new expedition overseer. You will reach the Sea of Mist, and you will travel beyond it, beneath it, in search of the Alta Pearl. Edis, please be careful. Whatever you find out there, promise me you'll return. I will. The order avails. This is a cool game. I like this a lot, how it plays. Let's see, is there another mission in the, in the demo, or is that the end? Hear that, Hammers? I'm oh. in charge of an expedition now. You'll have to listen to me. <laughs> anyway, we better prepare. First things first, we need to found a settlement to gather ourselves. From there, we can push out. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so we have to build our own base. Well met. You survived the first night of this comic, but there's more to be done. In a skirmish mode, you 
you will be able to free build outside the storyteller's constraints, and new soldier types may be recruited. But be wary, new horrors may also lurk in the binds of the swamps. Interesting, so I can click somewhere. Oh, so that... Okay, gotcha. So that's the end of the demo. Well, perfect! That was Cataclysmo. I really like that game. I'm excited for when it comes out. It comes out supposedly sometime this month. Um, it's on Steam if you want to try the demo right now. When this video is live. With that, have a wonderful day, everyone. Or a good night or a good evening. I'll see you all next one. Goodbye, everybody.